guys I got something I want to I talk got about. something to say hello how about that ride in guess that's why they call it Sin City ha 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 you guys might not know this but I consider myself a bit of a loner I tend to think of myself as a one-man wolf pack but now that I'm with you guys my wolf pack has grown by two where it was one, now it's three. The three of us wolves running around the desert together in Las Vegas looking for strippers and cocaine. So tonight I make a toast. Give me that bottle. To a night we'll never remember. Salud. Tastes like cough syrup. Booze, 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 boozy booze. Booze, 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 not to be confused with boobs. Boobies. All right, everybody, welcome uh, to this episode of. Booze review. Good one on our booze review here. Not to be confused as boobies. Yeah. yeah. We got the K Ripple in the house. Oh man, a fluffy gamer right here. We're back where it all started. Good one hunters and the booze review. Las Vegas, Nevada. Oh yeah. Today, as you might have gotten a hint from the little skip at the beginning there, we are reviewing none other. Then Jägermeister. Oh shit. In which Ryan has been doing some homework to tell us about Jägermeister. So Ryan, can you tell us what does Jägermeister mean? Well, Jägermeister literally translated is hunting master. Hunting master. Apparently the original distiller of Jägermeister's son was an avid hunter. And uh, Jägermeister, Hunter probably, of, probably that too. Uh, hunter of animals. Oh, okay. mm -hmm. um, some people like pussy. Some people like animal pussy. You yeah. know, potato, <laughs> potato, tomato, yeah, tomato. Yeah, there you go. But um, oh yeah, Jägermeister was uh, a title for a high-ranking official in charge of hunting and that shit. Well, and, and, and what? Time. What, era what era was this? Because that's important. 1934. 1934, Zig Heil. Yeah, a year. A year in after Germany. Hitler got his yeah. uh, chancellorship. The New Reich, right? Yeah. Uh, was it the Third Reich? The Third Reich. Thousand the year Reich. Third Reich. Yeah. It was supposed Jaeger to last was created. a thousand years. So, what we're going to do is we're gonna we're gonna do two things one we've already had a shot of Jaeger as you guys seen in these badass little booby shot glasses Ooh, she, oh, got, she got she got she got a butt too and um, we made a little mistake when we filmed that and we didn't have the Jaeger cold so it hurt it hurt oh, pretty bad it burned so it burned. we've had the Jaeger on ice for a while now so we're gonna do another Jaeger shot. Well, not me. Ryan and I are. He is not a big liquor fan. He's I'm more. Up. He's more of a lick him fan. So <laughs> Ryan and I will do. We'll do so. You got the Jaeger shots. over there. Because <laughs> it's fucking hilarious. It's fucking hilarious. It's fucking hilarious. Did anybody ever tell you you look like a young Tom Cruise? No. Injured dead. Yeah, I don't know how that. So here we go. You, you got, you got some up. risky business going on over here. Pulling it up. Oh yeah, there you go. Oh. Okay. And due to the fact that we got a little teeny but tiny baby bottle of Jaeger, we're not going to do full shots. We're going to do like half shots. Just enough, just enough to get the uh, 
the flavor here. But now that it's cold, it should go down a little smoother. And and um, I'm not gonna sit here and pretend that this is the first time I've ever had Jaeger. I'm a big Jaeger fan. But every time I have Jaeger, I always keep it in the freezer. You get that nice frost on the outside of the bottle. Mm -hmm. So definitely recommend if you're drinking Jaeger, keep it in the freezer when you're not drinking it. So when you do drink it, it's nice and cold. Yeah, and it won't freeze. So, uh, won't Ryan, freeze. bottoms up. Yeah. Love it. See, the nice thing, what I like about Jaeger, as opposed to, well, this is 35% alcohol, so 70 proof. 70 oh, proof. God. Most drinks that are 70 proof or higher, you get a good burn, I including Jaeger. There's a little burn. But the thing is, because of that black licorice flavor, it's, a liqueur. it's kind of like a cooling yeah. burn, like a, a weird, different type of burn. It's a neat. Like that's the uh, that's the ingredient that produces that like, like coffee. Mm. Okay. Yeah. 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 And uh, yeah. Vapors cough drops. So uh, yeah. Oh I know. Mm -hmm. Oh I know. Again? So all right, all right, all right. All right, all right. I accept all that. Right. I accept that. All right. So here it is. Uh, what we're gonna drink with the Jaeger was a beverage discovered by Ryan. Called the Tootsie Roll. No. Oh the no. Tootsie the Tootsie Roll. Yeah, is, it's Kahlua. Is Kahlua and root beer. Yeah, we <laughs> that's a Tootsie Roll. The, what we're gonna drink is okay, Jaeger the drunken, Tootsie Roll. The drunk German. Right here. The drunken German. Yeah. Drunk, drunk German. Drunken German. Jaeger and root beer. Which, if you if you if you know the flavor of black licorice, Yay! or if you know what Jaeger Whatever. tastes like, and root beer, you know those two they kind of seem like they're gonna fit. They're gonna go together. Yeah, and I highly Sounds recommend like that you drink Jaeger. Yeah, I was, yeah, it's it's a very good. Da in, da in, in crack. No, it's yeah. Ya. Right? Ya? Ya. Yeah. Yeah. Da. da. That's a Russian. Oh, okay. Yeah. 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 Whatever. Hey, Something. dude, I took three years of German. Don't ask me if I remember any of it, but, you know, I know what Jägermeister means. That's about it. Yeah. Thanks to Google. Yeah. <laughs> oh, yeah. All right, so here we go. Dude, we, we have our complimentary <laughs> hotel room cups here. Here, I'll pass them out. You guys can uh, D. Condomize your own cups. It's too big for me. Hey man, not my problem. Here, too buku, too buku, Me love you long time. Yeah. Pure Alabama black. You want fucky fucky? Me love you long time. Small. Now this will this work. Me love you long time. Am I drinking that shit? Yeah, yeah, yeah. We're doing, uh, we're doing, we're doing um, drunken Germans. We're well, not. We're not doing it straight. It. We're not doing it straight. We're doing right, drunken right. Germans. So. All right. And that's well. That's it though. So you get the light one. All right. Cool. That'll work. We are now out of Jaeger. Yay. Uh, after don't go nowhere because after we're done with Jaeger, uh, Ryan and I will also be giving you our thoughts on Sam Adams Summer Ale. And uh, Ryan and I have a little history with the Sam Adams Summer Ale. It's a delicious beer. But uh, we'll get more into that in just a minute. Yeah, let's drunk. Let's go. We, we got the A and W root beer. That'll be our official root beer for this particular beverage. Rub it up in your thumb. Look at that, man. Look at that. And the nice thing is, I remembered to pour the liquor in first this time. Yeah. Oh, good. Remember that? We, yeah. We drank that um, pure yeah. vodka. Let's go to a flashback. Cheers. Salud. Jesus Christ, that's all vodka. Wow. I <laughs> can't. But uh, yeah, when we drank it, man, it was just pure vodka and it hurt like a son of a bitch. Yeah, dude. You all right? Go ahead, go ahead, hold on to that. Don't drink that yet. Don't drink that yet. And uh, try to pour, uh, try not to pour this down the back of your uh, neck there. Oh, sorry. Yep. 
My bad, boom, 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 boom. All right, so drunken Germans, let's see how they taste. Bottoms up. Tastes like root beer with a little bit of an aftertaste. It tastes good. I like it. Root beer with a little bit of an aftertaste. That's how it's supposed to be. It was uh, three parts root beer to one part Jaeger. And that's about, so, based on the amount of Jaeger we had left to yeah. pour in these, that's about where we're at. So, yeah, you're not really supposed to taste like Jaeger. Mm -hmm. Yeah, no, that's good. Well, Jaeger, just the flavor just blends right in with the root beer. Yeah. Well, they're both, uh, which there's, no burn. Burn. there's no burn. There's no burn on it. It's um, how, how many ingredients were in Jägermeister? There are 56 uh, ingredients in the Jägermeister. That's a lot of ingredients. Like uh, herbs and fruits and Crack. peel, citrus peel, and uh, other woody stuff. Would you say it's safe to say that Adolf Hitler enjoyed a Jägermeister from Oh, yeah, I, yeah. I'm sure he did. I'm sure he did. Well, in my, in my reading, I found out that Jägermeister was first uh, invented, discovered. Yeah. I don't know what the fuck. Yeah. But in '35, so yeah. and because it was called Jägermeister, and Jägermeister, like it said, was uh, the hunting master, or whatever it hunting said. Hunting master, yeah. Yeah, so it was like a top echelon for the. Oh, the yeah. civil servants or whatever. Yeah, it was like so a premium it, liqueur. It was like Germany's like unofficial yeah. liqueur. Yeah. So yeah, uh, I'm sure I'm sure Hitler the, had himself some meth and then <laughs> had himself some The key beer is bombs. not all things from nineteen thirties Germany were yeah. bad. No. So but fascism, fascism's on like the top of the list. Ah, uh, well, shit happens. Yeah. Right, Jews? Shit happens. Well, not just <laughs> Jews. I mean. I'm kidding. I'm kidding. You, you say that. Too soon? Come on, it's 40, 19 fucking 40. It's a long time ago. So it was like, what, 75 years ago? Fucking 75 years ago. What yeah, the fuck? That was, uh. It's still too soon. It's like six million Jews got burned. Yeah, no, it sucks. It sucks. I'm, I'm right there with you. Yeah. Hitler was a pretty. And what bad was that guy. one movie that we just saw recently? That with um, Liam Neeson. Yeah. Schindler's List. No, uh, no. Schindler's List. Yeah, yeah, that, was, yeah. that was an excellent awesome Liam fucking Neeson movie. Yeah. Awesome movie. Yeah. But yeah. the one I'm thinking of. Yeah, uh, there was black and white boobies in that movie. Yeah, yeah. Oh, black really? and white bush too. I haven't yeah. seen that. Movie. Yeah, no, when they when they corralled all the all the uh, all the Jews and they put them when they thought like all the they they put them in this chamber and they all thought that they were gonna like die and burn and then it ended up being a shower they thought they were gonna gas them yeah, yeah. but it ended up being a shower and they got cleaned up yeah but uh, and they were all freaking out but yeah well there was, yeah there was black and white yeah that there. that was the thing the, the jews didn't know if they were gonna get gas yeah well, they or didn't. if they were gonna get water in but a lot shower, of them so. thought they were just going through uh you know, going through you know the system, and Probably they went so downstairs and got gassed, and, yeah. You know, and, and just crazy shit, man. Crazy shit. But those Nazis, that yeah, man, man, not Nazis, man. But you know what though? There's a lot of bad people on the planet today. ISIS, all these guys, those guys can suck it. But for us, we're gonna go. We're gonna do some drinking. <clears throat> I was working on this tall can. The moral of the story, kids, is don't believe in organized religion. And don't. Uh, it's all don't, bad. Don't believe the hype. Yeah, don't. Don't believe the hype. Yeah. So, anyways, that was it. We're out of Jaeger. Oh, no, it's gone already. Um, yeah. So, we've got, like, ghost boobies now. We've and, got a um, lot of beer. We're going to drink... Sam Adams Summer Ale. Now I'm a big fan of Sam Adams, and, and I, I'm not gonna lie, I like beer. Um, I love alcohol. Sam Adams, though. Sam Adams, they usually put out a pretty good product. And this Summer Ale, a few years back, 
Ryan and I were down at the beach for 4th of July. We got shit uh, On Coronado Island in San Diego. Straight shit. And uh, we had beer. We drank all our beer. Well, we went back to the store for, for more. And all they had and was... I would pull it, and I didn't know it. <clears throat> but, they, yeah, they were out of, like, all the cheap beer. Yeah. Any type of cheap beer. So you had to, to one-up it. Yeah, I, I think the well, only domestic was Budweiser. Yeah, we weren't drinking Never Budweiser. Never drink that shit. Fuck butt wiper. Never drink it. So so we ended up picking out the Sam Adams summer ale and it was delicious. So I've been drinking it every year since. But that was the first time I had it. Down at the beach, Fourth oh. of July, watching fireworks, Coronado yeah. Island. And it was a great night. And you know what's hilarious? Two years later, this guy shows up and jinx the whole fucking thing, yeah. and all oh, the fireworks yeah. went Big off bang, in 18 boom. seconds. Oh yeah, that's right. That was the first yeah. time that uh, that was the I worst time, time, time that he fly off and yeah. I could show up, yeah. get ready to see some awesome the fireworks, whole thing and then fucking the whole, yeah, yeah, it all goes up in 10 seconds. Yeah. Yeah. Hey, well, don't worry about it. Our uh, I guess it's technically both Ryan and I. It's like our step cousins or whatever second step fucking I don't know somebody but they're really nice people but they were out here from New York remember Darcy's cousins were out here oh yeah uh, what's her Jennifer she just had the kid yeah Jennifer and her husband her Todd is that his, I can't remember I feel really bad I don't bad. know he reminds me they're not of watching a, it though so he reminds me of another guy I knew so but they were really cool people but I felt horrible because they were out here and uh you know the fireworks all went off at once, and and yeah. we we talked about how great it was to see the fireworks here and everything, and, and this guy had to fuck it all up. I did. Oh no, I don't. Was it the same year? Yep, yep, yep. He was there. They were there. Matt was there. We had a big old crowd that was year. Was it? Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Oh man. It's, oh, it took me a while to get the lid off because I don't know what happened. I used to have a bottle opener on here, but I don't now, and. Um, these require a bottle opener. Or I'm a big pussy and can't twist off the top. But You're a big I think pussy. Either. Oh, alright. Okay. Mm -hmm. You're forgiven. Um, so but anyway, Sam Adams Summer Ale. What do we got here? Uh, wheat ale brewed with lemon peel and grains of paradise. Grains of paradise. What do you think about this beer, Ryan? What do you got to say about Sam Adams Summer Ale? It's okay. Fuck off. Yeah. It's okay. Yeah. It's a great beer. It's I'm I mean, I'll drink it because it's beer, but I don't know. Sam Adams just doesn't. I don't. It's not hoppy. It's like malty. You're a un-American, unpatriotic fuck. Oh, because I'm, I'm bad-mouthing Samuel Sam Adams. Sam Adams, man. Dude, I'm not bad mouth. The man with some friggin' Isn't founding father and shit. Mm. He's no. local, right? He's uh -huh. a founding father. Sam Adams. He was from Boston. Oh, it's from You're Boston. thinking He's from Carl's fucking Boston. Boston. Okay. Sam yeah. Adams was fucking Boston. Was so that, 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 that movie that we were referring to, you know, uh, not Schindler's List, it was called The Gray Zone. That was. Is that where he where the wolves where he was with, with the wolves and shit in the snow? No, 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 no. Because that was horseshit. I love. I really like Liam Neeson as an actor. His political no. views can fuck off. No, but no, no, as no. an actor, Liam Neeson's great. But you, well, that but, was the Schindler's. That was Schindler's. Zone. But okay. this one, I'm th I'm talking about. This is with David Arquette. Yeah, he zone. made the another gray one. Zone. David Arquette. That yeah. David Arquette, man, he's the fucking man, dude. He's every time he's on a fucking talk show, he is always talking about fucking wasted. Talks. He's fucking wasted. He was on that new show that Craig Ferguson does, that celebrity game show or whatever it is. Yeah. And he was shit faced. It was fucking awesome. His eyes were all brick red. Yeah. He was laughing because how stoned he was. He was yeah. fucking wasted. If you want to see a very serious film serious. with David Arquette, check out the Gray Zone. It involves it, it, it involves uh, you know the the Nazi area where the Nazi camps and all this stuff where they actually use Jewish people to kill their own people. Hmm. I remember you talking about how you watched it not too long ago. I thought that was Schindler's List that I was watching. Well, yeah. Well, Schindler's List 
Yeah, one of them. But this movie right here, the, okay. the Gray Zone. And that's Liam Neeson in there too? I don't think, no, that's not Liam Neeson. Okay, the one uh, I was watching was Liam Neeson. Yeah. yeah. Schiller's uh, List, yeah. <laughs> that's Harvey Keitel. Harvey Keitel. Yeah, Harvey Keitel. Yeah, that's Steve Buscemi. Steve Buscemi. Steve Buscemi. Steve Buscemi. Steve Buscemi. Yeah. That's what I'm saying. What is this like the fucking follow up to the fucking Godfather? How do I not know? The fucking Sopranos. Yeah. If you ever come across a movie called The Gray Zone, check it out. It's mm-hmm. it's a it's a pretty. Good I do movie. like Steve Buscemi. I do. Like, Steve Buscemi is a great fucking actor. I'm gonna, you know, I'm gonna I'm fucking, hold you to that though. Dude, if, if I you see it, if don't you like it. You're gonna hear. If you didn't no, like it's fucking, good. it's pretty good. Boardwalk Empire, man, what a great series! Mm-hmm. What a great fucking series, and and the work that Steve Buscemi did on The Sopranos too, that was fucking great, man. You that know, was you know what's great. really gonna piss you off though? The whole time we haven't been recording. Just kidding. <laughs> Is it red? Is it red? It's red. I got gotcha. you. I, I can't. I'm fucking apparently drunk because I can't see it anymore. Yeah. Okay. All right. I knew I fucking. I made a joke. Huh? <laughs> Not <a> funny. <laughs> so that's it. Um. Cue the drunk guy dancing. <laughs>